Well, good morning. It is Saturday morning and trying out a different cars and coffee here this morning. I am at uh, Alchemy Coffee. Uh, I don't know if this is considered Summerlin. I, I guess it is. It says Summerlin right there across the street, so it must be. So uh, this is more, a little bit more of an exotic car gathering. So there's some really fun stuff here this morning. So I'm just going to walk through uh, the stuff that's here. It's not a big, big show, but man, there's some really nice cars here. And uh, so let's start off here with a, uh, looks like a brand new GT4 RS. This is really a stunner. Love the carbon fiber hood on this. These cars are just absolute monsters. I, I really, I like Porsches. I never really wanted to own one, but uh, the GT2, GT3, GT4 RS makes me want to. But man, these are really expensive cars. So uh, maybe, maybe I won't. Um, over the top Camaro build. Heavily modified Lambo doors. Seen this guy before. This is a really, really nice build. And then I brought out the Pantera this morning. So that's what I'm driving. Nice AMG. Everybody knows this Ferrari in town. So uh, you can't miss this. Just saw a GT4 RS. Now we got a GT3 RS. Love that that purple color. These cars look good with really wild colors on them. A wonderful McLaren over here. Completely blacked out. It's hard to even see it. This is, man, this is a stunner. Really a good looking car. Really like that. Let's walk around the back side of it here. And, uh, man, that, that is nice. <laughs> these GT, let's go back over to GT3 RS for a second. The wings on these things are huge. I mean, look at the... <laughs> Look at the size of that, the wing on this. That's like the size of a kitchen table. It's really, it's really big. All right, let's see what else is here because we want to get down here and take a look at the uh, Bugatti Veyron that's down here. So everybody gathering up here. Got a singer singing this morning. She's really good. And then there's this. It's rare enough to see a Bugatti Veyron, uh, but I happen to know the guy that owns it. And um, this one in particular is interesting because this was previously owned by the Stradman, uh, which if you watch his YouTube channel, you know who he is. But uh, this was his car. And one of the ways you know is by looking underneath the wing back here. See, it says Strad right there underneath the wing. So, <laughs> that's part of the story. So, this is kind of got a famous car, but it's a real beauty. So, I wanted to get that in here. And then over here, another Camaro, another Porsche. And, uh, you know, we've always got the different Japanese things that show up here. And usually when they do, something really interesting shows up, like this right-hand drive skyline. This is, uh, I guess if you're into the, the the whole JDM car scene, this, this is one of those Grail cars, right-hand drive skyline. Very nice. Very nicely done. I don't entirely understand the whole um, JDM car scene, but I'm learning a lot about it as I meet all the guys that, and gals that own these cars. And uh, man, oh man, some of these cars are built just, you can't believe how fast they are. And beamers, beamers, beamers. 
over here. I don't know how long this guy's been waiting for his coffee, but um, a long time, I think. So, nice newer BMW. I don't know what this is. Again, I'm not smart enough to know what all of these cars are the minute I see them. Oh, it's an M4. I probably could have guessed that. Nice. Beautiful color, too. And we got a few more cars showing up here as the morning goes on. But just wanted to grab some shots of some of the things that are here. So you saw the uh, GT4 RS here. And then right down here we saw the GT3 RS, the purple one. And uh, then this just pulled in. So now we've got a GT2 RS. So we've got the full complement of the uh, Porsche RS cars. Absolutely beautiful. Again, the gigantic wing on the back, but beautiful color too. I mean, if you're going to have a car that looks this way, you might as well have a fantastic color. And this is. So... GT2, GT3, and GT4 RS all here at Alchemy Coffee this morning. Nice turnout. Okay, you want to get the attention of a bunch of car nuts. There's a couple of ways to do it. If you got Aveyron, Porsche GT RS, two, three, or four. Or you can pull in in an aerial Atom. Now, grant you, you don't see this too often. And there you have it. And I'm guessing the owner is accustomed to this kind of attention when you drive one of these things around. So uh, there it is. Aerial Atom. Wild. Because everything's exposed on the car. There's no body on it. Nice ride. Thank you. I'm going to be heading off to another car show in Summerlin later this morning and uh, I'll shoot some video there. So, in the meantime, we got more. We didn't sleep. Here. More Japanese. Always plenty of stuff showing up. Okay, so uh, I'll either add some more footage to this or we'll just pick it up at the next car show. All right, thanks for watching. Hey, don't forget to like and subscribe.